Right, today we're going to be scanning something a little bit different on our Fuel 3D Scanner file. Um, right, let's uh, meet our subject for the day. Doug, come in. Good boy. Sit there. Right, so this is Doug and we're going to give it a go scanning. Right, now let's start our first scan. As you can see, Anna is holding a target above Doug's head and I'm looking at the screen because I've got a live feed of what the camera is, is seeing. And this is what we've got. So let's move it about, get rid of the colour. You can see it's picked up a lot of detail. Um, now, I'm just going to crop out all the noise, basically, from the rest of the scan and just keep the detailed bits and sections left. And look at that. Without the colour, you can really see how much detail it's picked up. Now we're going to have a go at scanning the other side of Doug's head. And this is what we've captured this time. He's got his mouth open a little bit. Um, it's still managed to capture some of the inside of his mouth as well. Again, we're going to crop the scan so that we're just left with the good section. And again, without the colour, you can see exactly what's picked up. For this scan, we thought we'd try capturing uh, Doug's fur on his back. And um, I'll just crop out the unnecessary bits. And without the colour, you can see it's picked up a lot of detail. So as you can see, the Fuel 3D Scan 5 is a single shot 3D scanner. Uh, we've got these scans of Doug, but we're wondering what we should do with them. Um, if you let us know what you think we should do, um, we'll give it a go. So we're thinking we could attach his face to a mug, a phone case, uh, even a dog bowl, and we'll print that out. So let us know what you think, and we'll do it. If you enjoyed this video, please like, comment, and subscribe. Also, come follow us on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. You can find out more about our products and services by visiting dream3d.co.uk.